To find out how to make these festive holiday centerpieces, stay tuned. These centerpieces are extremely easy to make. For the first centerpiece, you're just gonna take this tea light candle holder and these golden balls that I got from Target and you're going to glue them in a circle around the bottom of the tea light candle holder. I only had enough for one full row and then a piece of a second row. So if you want to completely do a few rows, then I would suggest that you get more than just one vial of the little gold balls or the silver balls. But you just continue this process, adding hot glue to the tea light candle holder and then adding the golden balls to them. Once you finish adding all of your gold balls, you'll go ahead and add a bow to the front of your tea light candle holder and that will add the finishing touch for our first centerpiece. For the second centerpiece I'm going to take these mini bells and I'm going to apply silver bells to the top three pieces of the candle holder where it's flat I had started with gold but I thought silver bells would be a little more appropriate and then I am going to take the red bells and do three down the front of the candle holder and it's going to represent Santa Claus. I did add the multicolored bells around the back of the centerpiece, but I liked it with just the red bells, but I did not have enough red bells to do three rows of only the red. So if you decide to recreate this centerpiece, make sure you grab a few packs of the mini bells. For the third centerpiece, I am going to do my rendition of a winter wonderland and I am going to take the silver balls that I also got from Target and I originally was trying to glue them on in a snowman shape but there is not enough space on the, this particular candle holder to do that. So if you get a candle holder that is a little bit bigger then I'm sure that you would be able to create a snowman shape. But I ended up adding two clusters of pearls and then I ended up going on the third side and creating a Christmas tree using the little silver balls. And I used one of the bells that was left over to signify the star at the top of the tree. And you'll end up seeing that in the final shot of the centerpieces. 
And of course, I went ahead and added my candles once I finished decorating each candle holder. And this is the final product. What do you guys think of this DIY? I think it's really cute and there are a multitude of ways in which you can decorate your centerpieces and make it fit your home decor. Also, if you recognize the garland in the background of this video, this was last week's Christmas video, our first one of the week. So make sure you go to my page and check out that video. And then just to complete the centerpiece look, I added this piece of gold ribbon, just kind of intertwined between the three candle holders. And it just adds another layer of festivity to it. You can also use like a green garland or the little twigs and berries and you can change up the look of the centerpieces that way as well leave me a comment down below and let me know what you guys think they look really pretty when you light them and they'll add a nice festive mood and then if you also want to add to the ambiance you can add a few drops of vanilla to the candle and it'll make the house smell like vanilla or if you have cinnamon extract you could add a few drops of cinnamon extract to the candles as well and the whole house will smell like cinnamon make sure you guys like the video leave me a comment down below subscribe to the channel and share this holiday video Hey DIY Clubbers, thanks for joining me for another holiday video. Make sure you stay tuned for the rest of the month of December for more holiday ideals. I love you guys so much. Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, make sure you're having a great day and always keep creating. Happy Holidays!